Does your libido lag these days? Are you unable to find the strength to get up in the morning and build out a great day ahead? Can focus on your job or initiate some quality time with friends or family? There's a very good chance you're experiencing symptoms of low testosterone. If you are experiencing such symptoms, you should keep on watching because for today's video, we will uncover the 10 surprising foods that destroy testosterone. Stay tuned and learn more. Number 1. Soy Soy is high in fiber and protein as well as cholesterol and lactose-free. Such benefits don't suggest that you could be ingesting a testosterone-killing food, yet debate within the medical community wages on. Soy generally contains a large volume of phytoestrogen isoflavones, estrogen-like compounds found in plants. These phytoestrogens can trigger estrogen receptors in your body, but they can also decrease the activity of your androgen receptors, to which your testosterone binds itself. If it can bind to those receptors, then your testosterone can perform as it should, and therefore neither can you. According to a 2013 study, researchers found that men drinking 20 grams of soy protein isolate per day over a two-week span showed lower T levels than those that drank whey protein isolate or a placebo. Meanwhile, a 2010 meta-analysis uncovered no adverse effects on male hormones. Before we move on, a like would be awesome. Number 2. Dairy Think twice before you help yourself to that cheese platter or a tall glass of whole milk. Several studies indicate that dairy products can lower your testosterone levels. Pregnant female cows are the primary source of milk that's produced and sold commercially, and their milk is filled with estrogens and progesterone. Those hormones adversely affect testosterone by suppressing gonadotropin-releasing hormone, or GnRH, which men need for the release of follicle-stimulating hormone, FSH, and luteinizing hormone, LH. When they're not released, your testes can synthesize testosterone. A 2010 analysis supports the adverse relationship between dairy products and men's hormones. It's also worth noting that 98% of soybean meal is used for animal feed, so chances are that estrogen levels in cow's milk are even further bolstered. If you really crave milk, go with low fat or skim and make sure it's fortified with vitamin D, which is good for your testosterone. Number 3. Alcohol an occasional drink won't necessarily give your hormones a hangover. However, if you like to frequently imbibe beer, spirits, or wine, your testosterone could plummet. There is extensive research that too much alcohol impedes the functionality of your hypothalamus, pituitary gland, and testes. Like with dairy, the hypothalamus can't release GnRH, the pituitary gland can't release FSH and LH, and your testes can produce testosterone. In short, if you're continually overserved, your hormones become underserved. Even worse, they pay for it all. A recent report detailed a study in which healthy male volunteers received ethanol, or grain alcohol, equal to a pint of whiskey per day. Those volunteers' T levels began dropping after three days. After 30 days, their significantly deficient testosterone levels closely resembled those measured in alcoholic males. Besides being a testosterone killer, overconsumption of alcohol can be bad for your body in so many other ways, including your liver, kidneys, and heart. Moderation is key, so please drink responsibly. Number 4. Baked Goods Who doesn't love a good cookie or loaf of bread, especially straight out of the oven? Sadly, many baked goods are high in trans-unsaturated fatty acids, aka trans fats, which is heavily associated with causing T levels to decline. According to a 2017 study, the subjects who ingested foods rich in trans fat showed testosterone levels 15% lower than those with the lowest intake. It's not just the trans fat that'll get you. Baked goods like pastries, danish, pies, and other sweet treats can increase your insulin levels as well as your waist size, both of which can leave you with low T and a bad taste. Consider this the next time you're tempted to treat yourself to that second donut. Number 5. Sugar Having a sweet tooth could cause your tea levels to sour. Sugar is already associated with a ton of health issues. Perhaps it's a little easier to reduce sugar intake if you have a better idea of what it can do to your hormones. One study documented that males 19 to 74 experienced as much as a 25% drop in testosterone levels following sugar ingestion, with levels remaining lowered for up to two hours. Love soda and energy drinks? Researchers reported that sugar-sweetened beverages were associated with low T levels in 59% of subjects. Of all the testosterone-killing foods on the list, sugar is arguably the easiest and the most difficult one to eliminate from your diet. Number 6. Mint 
Spearmint and peppermint have long been lauded as herbal remedies for stress, digestive issues, and sinuses. Plus, they can really help freshen your breath. Unfortunately, some research indicates that when it comes to male hormones, mint may stink. According to an animal study, the testosterone levels of rats that were regularly given peppermint or spearmint tea declined in comparison to a control group that received drinking water. Another study found that spearmint induced oxidative stress in rats, resulting in decreased testosterone. More research needs to be done, particularly with human male subjects, before an adverse relationship is definitively established between mint and low testosterone. Until then, may we suggest you spice up your daily routine with some ginger tea, especially since ginger is known for boosting testosterone production. Number 7. Trans Fats We've already touched on some of these since they're key ingredients in several aforementioned testosterone-killing foods, but it's worth expanding on the topic that trans fats can be disastrous for your hormones. Though there are natural traces of trans fat in meat and dairy, you'll find an overabundance of them within processed, fried, and fast foods. The list of health risks associated with those foods is vast. Cardiovascular disease, inflammation, type 2 diabetes, decreased HDL good cholesterol and increased LDL bad cholesterol, and low T and decreased fertility. Number 8. Vegetable Oils Vegetable oils are hydrogenated to improve food's taste, texture, and shelf life. They're also dense with polyunsaturated fats or PUFAs. Though they're often labeled as healthy fat, PUFAs must be ingested in moderation. Commercial vegetable oils, which are often refined combinations of canola, coconut, corn, cottonseed, olive, palm, peanut butter, safflower, soybean, and sunflower oils, are used in cooking so many foods, it's easy to overconsume PUFAs. One study established a strong correlation between men's low testosterone levels and their frequent consumption of polyunsaturated fats. Meanwhile, a 2019 report revealed how PUFAs decrease the T levels of overweight hypogonadal men in as little as one hour after consumption, with effects lasting up to five hours. Lastly, you have your omega-6 fatty acids, which you'll find in many of those vegetable oils as well as various nuts and seeds. Omega-6 can be considered a rather healthy type of PUFA when consumed in moderation. It can lower your bad cholesterol, improve your good cholesterol, and help reduce the risks of certain cancers and heart disease. However, they're not as healthy as omega-3 fatty acids, yet they're consumed far more in excess. And contrary to popular belief, you can have too much of a good thing. Research supports that too much omega-6 can not only decrease testosterone production, but can also reduce testicular size and function and increase inflammation in the body. Number 8. Nuts Certain nuts can wreak havoc on your hormones. Nuts have earned a great reputation for containing healthy fats and minerals, but several studies show how nuts high in polyunsaturated fatty acids, including walnuts, pistachios, peanuts, pecans, and almonds, can cause oxidative stress to storage tissues, which in effect can lower your tea levels. Number 9. Flaxseed There's no question that flaxseed offers health benefits such as improving cholesterol levels and digestive health and reducing blood pressure. Too much of it, though, can turn into a testosterone killer. Flaxseed is an extremely rich source of dietary lignans. Lignans are plant-based compounds that can cut down the total and free T levels and prevent the conversion of testosterone into something helpful. The much-needed androgen dihydrotestosterone. In one small study, 25 men diagnosed with prostate cancer adopted a low-fat diet supplemented with flaxseed. Researchers observed significant declines in total and free testosterone. Additionally, flaxseed is rich in omega-3 fatty acids. Though it's preferable over omega-6, some research indicates that too much omega-3 can also contribute to lowering testosterone levels. Number 10. Licorice Root Licorice root is different from licorice in the form you're familiar with in the candy aisle. It's often used as an herbal supplement, tea, or a beverage sweetener. However, men's hormones may not be so sweet on licorice root. According to a small study, testosterone values in men plummeted by 26% after consuming 7 grams of licorice root daily for one week. Can you avoid eating these 10 testosterone destroyer foods? Let us know in the comments below. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. For more interesting facts on the human body, subscribe to the channel. 
Here are two more videos you should check out, both of them will definitely help you reach your goals.